Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to reset ZTE Blade A36. Okay, we have two methods how we can reset this device. Let's begin with the first option, that is also a recommended one. We need to open up the settings. Now, simply scroll down all the way until you find system and update. And now on the bottom we have the reset options. We are interested in the last function, erase all data, so we need to click on that. Of course, remember that everything will be mm, erased from your device, uh, all of the data. And now to reset your device, we need to click on Erase All Data, this button mm, on the downside of the screen. Uh, and after that, our device will be turned off. After a few seconds, it will be automatically turned on again. And the next thing that we need to do is to go through the setup process. That's the first method. Now let's begin with the second one, which is a reset using the recovery mode. But when it comes to this option, you need to be aware of one thing that after the reset if you have a screen lock set of course uh, and if you are locked in into google account after the reset during the setup process your phone will want you to verify yourself or by typing the screen lock that you had before the reset or by logging in into the google account into which you were locked in before the reset so remember about it now to perform a reset using the factory Using the recovery mode, we need to power off our device, simply hold the power button for around one second, and now select power off. And now, to launch the recovery mode, we need to hold the power button and volume up button at the same time. When the ZTE logo appears, we need to release the finger from the power button, but we need to keep holding volume up. Let me show you. So hold power and volume up. When the logo appears, release the finger from the power button, but keep holding volume up. And now we are in the recovery mode. To move around this menu, we use the volume keys. Now we need to select wipe data slash factory reset, click uh, the power button to confirm. In here you can also uh, see the thing that I was talking about before. You may be required to connect to a network via SIM or Wi-Fi and log in Google account before using the device. Okay, now select factory data reset, click the power button, the process has now started formatting data and data wipe has been completed so we can select reboot system now confirm by clicking the power button and now we just need to simply wait until the phone turns on all right and that's all in this video thank you all for watching if you found this video helpful please leave a like comment and subscribe